Let's try this way. Okay, we definitely need strength to go over there. What cave am I in? Where am I? What am I doing here? I feel unsafe. Like I shouldn't even be here. Oh, you know, you actually can get around to them. All right, so we got a double. We'll have Gyarados and who else do we want? Truck Mew? Sure. Why not? What a dynamite combo. Gyarados and Truck Mew. Wandering around, I got hungry, so I ate some wild mushrooms. They gave me gas, and now I can't stop burping. Blur. Okay. Look, a trainer lost in Wayward Cave. So this man's found some wild mushrooms growing, decided to eat them, and now he's gassy. And he decided to tell us all of that. Whatever, we've got Onyx, we've got Geodude, we've got Gyarados and Truck Mew. This looks like bad news for Geodude and Onyx, though. Because Gyarados knows a water move, and Mew knows a grass move, though Gyarados is running out of PP. We only got three PP left. He can take out Geodude. Mew can take out Onyx, right? Bam. Oh my god, he's got Sturdy again. That's all they ever have. Does Geodude know Sturdy too? No. No, he does not. Thankfully, didn't have to hit him again. Barely get any experience. Alright, we got a Smackdown. Flattened my Gyarados. It's super effective, but it didn't do shit. Okay, I'm going to just bite Onyx. And I guess Mew can deal with whoever. Just bullet Seed Machop. Machop's not very heavy, I would imagine, so... Grass not probably not going to do a whole lot against the job. Can we get a third bullet seed? Yes, nice. It's plus two points from you right there. Plus two from you. Mew's gaining points. Gyarados is biting rocks. He's doing his best. And we're out of here. Straight from the battle plan. Give me your money and we're out of here. I hear there's a Pokemon that has mushrooms growing on its back. Not around here, somewhere far away. I wonder if the mushrooms taste any good. Me? No, I'm not lost. I live here. Okay. Well, I guess we can just keep exploring because I don't, I don't know where... Oh, there's another double battle here. Okay. I mean, you could do them one by one, but... Did you come to play too? Want to play battle with me? Hush now, lost little Pokemon. Don't you cry, I'm here to take care of you. Okay. How many Pokemon they got? Like, four, maybe? Yeah. Got a Bidoof and a Bunnery. Bunnery. Intimidate that Bidoof. Put him in his place. And that Buneary, too. Well, I guess we could just bite. Right? Let's just bite. I'm gonna eat this rabbit. Truck Mew seems... Wait, what does Truck Mew seem worried about? I don't know what Truck Mew's worried about. I'm gonna rock tomb this Bidoof. Nice, he's dead. What was it? He was like level 13. <laughs> I'm just bullying these trainers at this point. Oh, come on, Baneary. Why couldn't Baneary just die? Look at that. Like, no health. I think Zubat might die. Just a hunch. Oh, yeah. Unless Zubat had Sturdy, which I guess I should assume everyone has Sturdy. Eat that rabbit. Mmm. Delicious rabbit meat. 
that it, or do they? I think they got one more. Oh, they got an A-Palm. An I-Palm? A-Palm? I-Palm? It's probably not A-Palm. It's probably I-Palm. I've never seen this Pokemon before. At least, well, I've seen it before, but not in this game. Let's hit it with the Bullet Seed. This thing's probably dead. The combined efforts of Mew and Gyarados? Come on. Mew's, just t made, Mew's taking care of it themselves, apparently. Another plus one for Mew. Mew's racking up points. Gyarados doesn't do anything, like, impressive, I guess. Magikarp slash Gyarados has gained or lost. They haven't done anything. They've neither gained nor lost points. Everyone else, though. Others oh, double team. Well, not sure I really care about double team, but. I would ride the bike, but I don't know. I'm kind of scared that I'll run into more Pokemon. Oh my fuck. Yeah, I'm not using the bike. I feel like you, ru you definitely run into more Pokemon if you're on the bike. I have nothing to back that up besides, like five minutes of experience, but at this point, it seems like being on the bike attracts more Pokemon. So, I'm going to get off the bike. It seems like we make it much further not riding the bike. I don't know where else to go, though. Who the hell is this? I didn't catch this thing. Bronzor. Is this thing related to Resnor? Doesn't look like it. Okay, we got an Intimidate. Cool. Um, I'm gonna tackle, because this thing has, like, it's very low level compared to me. Not very effective. Okay. Cool, a Confuse Ray? Maybe I can just throw a ball and catch it. I don't feel like dealing with Confusion. No, let's let Gyarados try to deal with this. Will you gain or lose points, Gyarados? That plus two for Gyarados. He's finally on the board, somehow. I think that's the first time that Gyarados gained or lost any points, so... Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna throw a ball. Let's throw a ball. Frag out. I don't know how good this is gonna be, but... Let's try it. Yeah, beautiful. I have no idea what to nickname this, so we're just gonna immediately move on. Gyarados actually leveled up off of that somehow. Congratulations, I guess. Wants to learn Crunch? Isn't that like a better bite? I guess we'll see. Use your crunches up the target with sharp fangs. This may also lower the target's defense stats. So it has more power, but it there's no flinch on it. I think I'm just gonna get rid of... Well, I guess I could get rid of Splash. Splash is hot garbage, so... We'll keep Bite for now. Bite will probably get removed later. Splash, fuck Splash. Splash is a piece of crap. Implements sh shaped like Bronzor were discovered in ancient tombs that is unknown whether they are related. Interesting. I got no nickname for you. I could call you Shieldy, but whatever. Send him to the box. Out of my hands. Let's keep going. I feel like I've already come from this way, but I don't know. I'm somebody that strongly benefits from a mini-map slash map. And not being able to check kind of a mini-map, I don't think there's one in Pokemon. Like, I can open up the town map, obviously, but that's not really... Well, I could try current location. What does that do? I think that just, like... Yeah, it just sends me back there. Okay, I didn't really do what I wanted. Let's go this way. I know we definitely have not been up over here. I think. We got an escape rope. I don't even know where... Do we just go to the outside of the cave? Or do we go back to the last, like, Pokemon? I guess... Probably just outside the cave, right? Not the Pokemon, but like a Poke Center. I don't know. Who the hell are these people? I should probably battle them before I, like, move on and forget about them. 
Alright, truck me. Everyone's like level 24, you know? Let's get, uh... Let's get Chimtini out here. We got the Chimtini Gyarados experience coming up fresh for you guys right here. What every good picnic needs is a cute setting, good food, and a fun battle. Huh, are you lost too? No, it doesn't matter. Let's have a quick Pokemon battle. And we got a Buizel, we got a Meditite. I know Buizel's water, apparently. I don't know, Meditite fighting, maybe? I have no clue. It looks like a baby in a diaper. I'm not too worried about it, so... We got Flame Wheel, probably not very good against Buizel. I'm gonna go ahead and punch Buizel in the fucking face, and Gyarados is going to eat the baby in a diaper. Break! Let's go, boys. Bam! Baby in a diaper, dead. Diaper baby, gone. Don't even worry about it. That thing was creepy anyway, it's out of here. We don't gotta worry about it. I'm glad I could kill it, so that way... Oh, come on, does it have Sturdy too? No, I just, I just apparently, I just apparently couldn't one-hit it by that much. What an asshole. We're Fury Swiping. Tackle, we won't need any of this. Gyarados is fat. Well, I guess Gyarados is pretty quick. I need to check my Pokemon speed again. I remember, I remember Magikarp was like my third fastest Pokemon, but that was also when it was a Magikarp, and it's a Gyarados now, so... Its speed is probably be It seems faster than my monkey, so... Definitely seems faster. Yeah, Gyarados is definitely faster. Bam! That wasn't any fun for me. Not fair, we're not on the same level. Yeah, I don't, it's not my fault, I'm just... I'm just over-leveled. Why have a picnic here? I don't know, there's no deep meaning to it. I got separated from my friends, I've got my Pokemon with me, so I'm okay, but... Okay, we can't go anywhere down there because we need strength, I'm assuming, to push this shit around, or you just can't get past it. So I think we're going to hit a dead end here. Okay, I guess we'll go... Oh, come on. There's probably not any Pokemon that I haven't seen. I guess there could be, like, some rarer spawning Pokemon here, so... I'm pretty, I'm pretty close to just using a Repel, damn it. I'm going to threaten to use a Repel constantly. If I run into something again pretty quickly, I'll use a Repel. Maybe. That was kind of quickly. What is this? It's another Geodude? Or... I'll give him maybe a couple more tries to see if I can catch anything. I wish I could, like, skip or speed up some of this, like, pre-battle stuff. Like, the Pokemon coming out and, like, intimidating each other and shit. It starts to take a little bit too much time, I feel like. It'd be nice if you had the option to skip it, right? Just the option. I think this is probably the last battle we're doing here. Where am I? Am I lost? Who are you? Are you a Pokemon trainer? You're lost, aren't you? I'll guide you if you can beat me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He'll guide us if we can beat him. I got bad news for you, dude. You're about to get fucking body. You have a double Silcoon? Are you guys for real? Double Silcoon. And we got the Intimidates coming out. Bam. Oh, wait, we have a Silcoon and a Cascoon. Okay. Well, guess what? It doesn't really matter because I have fire, so. Uh, I guess Gyarados will just crunch him up. Bam! Get him out of here, Gyarados. I forgot to check speed stats again. I don't know why I care, but I kind of care. I want to know who's fast, you know? I gotta know who's fast on my team. 
Where are the speedy boys at? Which which ones are they? I know it's Truck Mew and Gyarados at this point, apparently. Definitely not Jiminy. Jiminy only has 43 speed. I don't think that's very good. We got a Dust Ox and a Beautifly. That's fine, because I've got more fire for your stupid bug Pokemon. And Gyarados is hungry as usual, so... Hit him with the crunch. Hit him with the flame wheel. We call it a day and we get the hell out of here. Oh, truck me leveled up. Holy shit, look at that. Four health, three defense. Damn. 71 speed. Mew is so fast. Comparatively to my team. I don't know. I don't know about comparatively to everyone else's Pokemon, but. Comparatively to my own and these random trainers, pretty fast. Yeah, Chimtini only has like 56 speed. Okay, so we're both trainers. That's a start, right? I said I'm gonna win. Well, doesn't matter what you say. Sometimes it doesn't happen. I can declare that I'll win the lottery. That doesn't mean that it'll happen. Mmm, rare candy? Nice. Who should I give this to? Probably Chimtini. I'm probably giving this to Chimtini. Why not? Uh, an item to be held by a Pokemon. Boost the power of poison-type moves. Cool. There's the rare candy. I don't really have poison type moves, I don't think. Well, let's feed this rare candy to... Actually, let's wait. I think I learned this last time. Let me check the summary. You know, actually, Chimtini did just level up recently. It looks like. So I'm just going to go ahead and feed this candy to them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did waste that, like, that first rare candy I got, I think was just, like, completely wasted, so. That one was a lot better, though. Chimtini had barely leveled up. I think we just have to leave now. I think I just need to get out of here. I don't, I don't know where else I can even go in here. I'm pretty sure I've explored a fair bit of it. We gotta go. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. There could be some other cool shit in there, I don't know. I'm leaving. Oh shit, there's a Ponyta down here? I'm gonna catch it. I don't know about Chimtini. Chimtini looks a little worried about being able to battle well. What? There's some sort of background mechanic. I have no clue what's going on. There's something. Mew was, Mew was concerned about something. Now Chimtini's concerned about something. I don't know what's happening. But it's fine. Okay, we got a growl there. That could be good. I kind of want to try bite. I'm going to bite. You think it'll kill it? Oh, it's going to kill it, isn't it? I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. It's probably going to kill it. Okay, it didn't kill it. That's good. It didn't do as much as I had hoped, but it's not dead, so... Let's try to frag out a Pokeball. Here we go. You ready? Frag out! There you go. That's all, all there is to it. That's all there is to it. About an hour after birth, Ponyta's fiery mane and tail grow out, giving the Pokemon an impressive appearance. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. It's, like, all fiery and shit. Pretty nice. Too bad I already have a fire Pokemon, so... And I don't really know a nickname to give to it, so we're just gonna send it to the box. I already have Chimtini. That's probably good enough. Well, that's cool. Nice Ponyta out here. Not too bad. It was a new Pokemon. It looks cool. There's another one. Don't know if I wanted to see a second one, but... Why does Chimtini shake when he comes out? He, just, he has a little shake when he comes out. I don't know what's going on with my Pokemon. They're like, something's going on with them. Why is there a third Ponyta? I didn't need to see three in a row. 
I thought I thought I was kind of special finding one. Like maybe it was rare, but now that I've run into three in a row, I'm kind of feeling like not that rare. Holy shit! Please don't run into anything. Oh my god! Watch out! Whoa! Watch out for this grass. Whoop. I ran through a lot of it, but it didn't matter, so it's fine. That was a fun little adventure back there. Now we get to move on. We're on Route 207. Oh shit, there's a cutscene. Oh shit, it's Dawn. Hi, Shaytini. How's your Pokedex coming along? Me? I'm somewhere between fantastic and uh, hopeless. But this isn't about me. I've got something nice for you. Shaytini, choose which hand you want. I want the right hand. I see you want the Versus Seeker. I'm impressed, Shaytini. You know what's important. I have no clue what this is. I, You probably get the same item no matter what. I don't know. Using that Versus Seeker, you can find trainers who want to rematch with you. Oh, Shaytini, do you also have a Poketch? Yep, you do. You can have this too, then. You deserve it for all your hard work, Shaytini. I am a hard worker. Damn it. We got the Dowsing Machine. You installed the app. The Dowsing Machine app can locate unseeable items. If the Dowsing Machine is something you should touch often. It will tell you if there is an item on the ground that you can't see. It will be especially useful inside dark caves. Okay, let's keep working on our Pokedexes. Professor Rowan is counting on us. Well, thank God I just got the dowsing machine after I left that dark cave. Thank God that lined up beautifully. Let me pull this bad boy out. Um, what can I do here? Nothing? Okay. Where's my dowsing machine? I'm pretty sure there's a quick way to, like, swap between apps, but... Oh, there's an item over there looks like. I don't know where... Oh, there's a couple items around here. No, it's like way back... It's like around here somewhere, maybe? Where the hell is this? <laughs> I can't find it. I'm guessing this is like dead, like my location. Oh, maybe it's like down in the grass somewhere. It's like down there. Well, there should have been another one over here, right? Yeah. So if I go like a... Oh, there it is. Hey, we got a revive. Nice. All right. I have a better idea how it works now. Trainer tips. Pokemon may become immobilized if they are asleep or paralyzed. If it happens to your Pokemon, it could be disastrous. If your opponent's Pokemon can't move, it's a big opportunity. Okay, we've got like a little waterfall down. Well, not a, a sand waterfall. Sand fall. No, yeah, we just... Come down here, okay. Um, let me close that for now. If you change gears on your bike, you can shoot right up that slope. Okay. Hey, there we go. Look at that. Bam. Nice. Let me collect all these berries over here. Let me get off my shit here. I just want off the bike. Thank you. I'm here to. I'm here to steal berries. I'm like the opposite of Johnny Appleseed. I just roam the land, stealing berries, and not replanting them. It's like if Johnny Appleseed had, like, an evil brother or something. I already read this. I don't know why I read that again. There is an item down over here somewhere. Apparently, we can go a couple ways. Oh, this is Orberg. Okay. Okay. Did I never come up here? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, okay. Let me just heal here. Heal it up, baby. I like this, like, smooth Pokemon-centered song. Very smooth. Relaxing. Calming. pretty nice. Uh, there should be an item somewhere over here. Once we get out of Geodude Hell, apparently. I need some water. Apparently that was not a long enough time to get water. It says I'm, like, right on an item. Where is it? 
Oh, there it is. A one Pokeball. Oh, man. That was... That was well worth it. All right. Let's get back on the bike. Let's ride up this. Okay, we're a little slow. Maybe I have to switch gears. Yep, let's swap gears. Bam. I think we have to go that way. Uh, I kind of don't want to be on the bike. I'm going to take off. I don't know. I don't like being on the bike. What's over here? Yeah. We got a... We got a Timmy run. Oh, shit, he saw me. I was hiding. I wear shorts the whole year. I've got energy to burn. What's that shit in the background? Like, looks weird when it loads. I thought, like, something was messed up with my monitor. I don't think so. Why does he have a Pidgey Jr.? Everyone's got the same unevolved crappy bird. And it's level 15, too. He's not letting it evolve on purpose. I'm pretty sure that thing evolved before 15, right? Maybe it was like 16 or 18. Maybe it was a little higher than 15. God, they have garbage. They have garbage Pokemon. And they only give you like 100 XP if you kill it. That's all they give you. Ninety. I didn't even get a hundred. Wait, he got a Chimchar from somewhere, dude. I'm about to mess his Chimchar up. I'm messing this Chimchar up. You think you got the better Chimchar? You think you got the better Chimtini, Timmy? Guess what? Guess what, little Timmy? I've been working on this Gyarados for a long time. He's out of here. Where did he get a Chimchar from? Having lots of energy isn't good enough. No, I don't think it is, but good try. Gotta start somewhere. My Pokemon don't wear anything. I worry that they'll be cold. All right. Well, we've got... Man. We've got a lot of places we can go. Laughter brings good fortune. Does it? Now I can drink more water now. Always good to drink water, you know? It's good stuff. Chimtini seems to be worried for some reason. I have no clue how to make him feel better, so I guess he's just gonna have to be sad for the rest of his life, which is a sad revelation, but... That's unfortunate, Chimtini. You're gonna have to cheer up at some point. No XP for that, basically. Another Geo, dude. Oh boy. Level 16 Geo, dude. Man, does he just have all Geo dudes and then like maybe one Graveler? I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait for this Geo dude extravaganza. Luxio levels up. Fantastic. Oh, a Zubat. Wow. Daring today, are we? Daring today. What do you think his fourth Pokemon is? Another Zubat? Another Geodude? Or does he have like a ringer? Like an Onix or some shit? No, he's got another Geodude. Apparently the Zubat was his ringer. That is unfortunate. Well, that's it for Kevin. Kevin's out of here. There's nothing that I can do but laugh. Yeah, sometimes you just lose so bad, you just have to laugh. I don't know. I don't want to laugh at him. Got a dire hit? I don't know what this does. Let's check it out. Is that like crit hit or something? No clue. Where's it at? I don't know. I'm, oh, there it is. An item that greatly raises the critical hit ratio of a Pokemon during a battle. It can be used only once and wears off if the Pokemon is withdrawn. So I guess just use this shit at some point. Probably on a gym battle or like, I don't know. Maybe I should save them for the very end of the game and then try to use them. Probably won't be able to get a whole lot out of them, but... 
Probably better than wasting them. We got a nice double battle here. Go for it, my Pokemon. I'll do my best to... Oh, was I too far out of range? Oh, no. She saw me. Thank God. I was like, if I'm out of range from the other trainer, I'm going to be kind of sad. I should probably try to make sure I'm in the middle of them, but I didn't think it would be an issue. Thankfully, it, it isn't an issue, but I guess it could be an issue. I kind of doubt it. We got Intimidate coming out. Nice. Let's go ahead and, I don't know, punch this squirrel-looking thing in the face, and then we'll waterfall Ponyta, and we're out of here. Maybe. No, that thing's tanky as fuck. Never mind. Ponyta should be dead, though. Ponyta's dead. Oh, yeah, Ponyta's dead. And a crit. Adds plus two for Gyarados right there. Nice job. Really adding insult to injury. Oh, and a level up? That's another plus one. Gyarados is gaining points here. I feel like it's a lot easier to gain points these days in Pokemon than the past, you know? It was a lot easier to lose points in the past. There was a lot of stupid shit that could happen. And also, I would do a lot of stupid shit just to try to, like, bait stuff into getting or losing points. Good times. Oh, we lost. Oh, we lost. Yep. You guys lost.